Hey pilot, welcome back to another video. Today we're talking about Seeker, the mech that will soon be available on the live server. First of all, I want to thank Ruffles for capturing the visual footage for me, as we currently have issues with the test server, and not every content creator has access to it. The link to Ruffles' YouTube account is linked in the video description. Seeker is an attacker with an energy capacity of 24, 193,000 hit points at maximum level and a speed of 22 kilometers per hour. This makes him the second attacker mech with an energy capacity of 24 instead of 32. With a speed of 22 kilometers per hour, he is one of the slightly faster and more agile mechs in Mech Arena. Let's talk about his ability. His ability is called Warp and teleports Seeker within a distance of 100 meters behind an enemy mech. That alone is absolutely nasty and will revolutionize the entire gameplay of Mech Arena. But that's not all. Once your mech has teleported, it automatically activates a shield that lasts for 7 seconds and has a shield strength of 34,200. After you've performed a teleportation, you can inflict damage for 7 seconds. After that, you will be automatically teleported back to the original location and then its cooldown of 8 seconds begins, so I strongly recommend using a cooldown implant here. As for weaponry, three options are suitable – Ember Gun, Rail Gun, or Missile Rack. We need weapons that cause immense damage at short distances in a short amount of time. Repeaters and the Fragment Gun would also be a good choice for Seeker. It's also worth mentioning the warp bonus damage. As I understand it, your weapons receive 30% more damage during the duration of Seeker's warp. Imagine that with a railgun or an ember gun. I think this mech will give us problems. I consider it overpowered and a mech before which even a well-positioned Aegis is no longer safe. Especially in control point conflict fights, this mech will be absolutely game-changing, and unlike other mechs like Nomad or Vortex, it's challenging to do without this mech if you don't want to be at a disadvantage. But what do you think of Seeker? Do you have mixed feelings about the mech? Are you excited or do you reject the mech? Let me know in the comments. See you in another video and until then, take care.